the biggest one-day music festival in America. Rockfest 2013. Saturday, May 11th at the Liberty Memorial. See Alice in Chains. See there. Papa Roach. Soul Beats. Hailstorm. Seven Dust. And many more. Tickets are going fast at all Ticketmaster locations. Looks like Rockfest on our homepage. Hey guys, what's going on? Nivens here. Time for your weekly rock wind-up. And don't go to Russia! It seems that Scott Lucas from Local H uh, ended up over there performing a, a little while ago. And after his set, was walking down the street, uh, got put in a chokehold, passed out, all of his sh** stolen from him, hat included, plus passport. Uh, thought he was going to be actually damaging his vocal cords where it could actually stop him from performing music anymore. It looks like the medication and taking time off is going to help him out and he'll be back on the road, hopefully uh, by the end of this month, or at least definitely into the month of April. Speaking of rock stars performing overseas, Tom Morello from Rage Against the Machine and Audio Slave fame uh, has been performing with Bruce Springsteen in the E Street Band over in Australia saying this is a, a huge highlight to my career. I've always enjoyed Bruce Springsteen and the E Street Band. Now to be able to play with them is pretty badass. Uh, definitely uh, it was being asked by an interviewer over there uh, what the plans are for Rage Against the Machine. There are none. It's like a unicorn. I haven't seen one today. As soon as I see one, I'll let you guys know. Paraphrasing what he said, of course. Well, Rob Zombie and ex-Marilyn Manson guitarist John Five had a bunch of guitars stolen from his house out in Los Angeles. It seems that he forgot to set his alarm, and according to him, some assholes got lucky. But on the local front, speaking of uh, some assholes getting lucky, my man Shane Borth from Flanagan's Right Hook, uh, also part of Quixotic Performing Troupe, had a bunch of stuff stolen from his car recently. Uh, I made a mention of it on Facebook and whatnot. I'll put the whole list up onto YouTube as well. They'll give a, basically a quick breakdown of everything. There's quite a bit of it. Uh, he's been staying in touch with uh, the local pawn shops as well as Craigslist. Nothing surfaced yet. Uh, hopefully if that does happen, uh, Shane will get all this stuff back. And in closing, San Francisco Bay Meddlers uh, Machine Head are going to be on the lookout for a new basis for this summer for touring. If you think you've got what it takes, you can audition uh, by, uh, by way of email. It's kind of funny. MH Bass, some of you will be bass. Uh, auditions at gmail.com. Uh, there is a, there's a criteria to actually audition for Machine Head. I'll make sure to have that posted as well. Uh, so uh, maybe you'll be out there rocking with Machine Head this summer. That'd be pretty cool. You know? I'm Nivens. Thank you very much for tuning in to your weekly rock wind up. Whatever you're doing this weekend, have a good time. Peace. Happy Easter. Jesus is risen! Praise Jesus, he's come alive! Hallelujah! Chocolate bunnies for everyone. Chocolate bunnies for everyone! Yes, can I get an amen?